Hey, what's going on you guys? This is Chad. Today, if you've got a brand new iPhone, I wanna show you how you can get all your iMessages and notifications on your PC. That's right, on your PC, not on a Mac. You don't need Hackintosh. You don't have to use a Mac operating system. This is a free piece of software. I'm gonna show you how you get from the Windows Store. If you would, do me a favor, click that thumbs up and subscribe. It really does help the channel. Without further ado, let's get into it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is head on over to this website, which is on the Microsoft Store on the web. Go ahead and click on Purchase. This is a free purchase, so go through the process, take it through, add it to your cart, purchase it. It'll say it's for free. Go ahead and do that. Next thing you're going to want to do is open up your Windows Store on your computer. Once you've opened that up, go to your library and you will now see this software, the Dell Mobile Connect software listed. Go ahead and install that and run this quick setup. You can see here, all you need to do is click get started. And if you have an iPhone or an Android, choose which one you're gonna set that up with. On your phone, this is then going to pop up with a code on your phone. Make sure you install the same software on your phone. This is the Dell Mobile Connect. You can find it in your app store. Key in that phone encryption code. It's going to go ahead and sync up to your computer. Once it's synced up, go ahead and open up the settings on your phone. Tell it to enable those notifications, just like you see here on the settings. And you also want it to sync your contacts. Now, once that is all taken care of, that's what's going to allow the notifications to pop up on your computer and have the access to it. So once that's done, it does show your device is connected. You can quickly check that by going into your system here. You can see if you scroll down into the Bluetooth settings that it should show your phone is now connected to your system. Just make sure that it does show up there. If it doesn't, you might have to go ahead and tell it to repair because you do have to have it listed in there. Once that's done, go ahead and open up the app. You can now see that you get notifications. You can send iMessages, people can send it back to you, and now it is all set up on your system.